buddies. <laughs> Whoa. You say hi to everybody? <laughs> Over there. Benny's two years old. You have to be right by my feet. They all say hi to you. We're just sitting on the balcony having some coffee. Uh, he eats Merrick's dry dog food. Good morning to everybody. Well, that's so exciting. You have to send pictures of your Bernice mountain dog to Benny's Instagram, but he can't see you with the floaty. sitting out on the balcony this morning because it's not too hot yet and he loves sitting on the balcony but it's usually too hot to be out here we are very much we like the apartment and we like the management What do you hear? <laughs> He's resting his head on her. Oh, everybody's getting burners. How much time of the day does Benny play outside? Um, we go outside in the morning to go potty. We'll sometimes do like a morning walk. And then at night he goes and runs around like crazy. Benny likes Culver's burgers. Right? We like our Culver's. Look at that noise. Boop. The hardest thing to take care of a Bernice Mountain Dog. Um, I guess, like keeping up with their hair or their fur can get difficult. Um, their neediness, mostly when they're puppies, can be difficult. We only got Benny in eight months, so I don't know what to feed a puppy, Bernice. You getting hot? It's 
not that hot, hot out yet. How do you know we live in a small apartment? Um, we've met up with a couple burners. I remember one girl burner was, her name was Maya. I think we know another one named Abby. We would like to buy Bernice, but is it necessary to have a big home with a lot of grass? Um, oh, no, you don't need a very big home and you don't need a lot of grass. I mean, as long as you can take them to the dog park and stuff. Are they always this happy looking? Yeah, they're very happy guys. Wait, you're happy boys. What's Benny's favorite activity in the summer weather? He likes to be a couch potato. We've been trying to take him swimming though. See, we live in Florida, so summer weather is a bit too hot. He prefers our winter weather in Florida. I can't even see you. Look how big he's getting. Yes, we've heard a burn of a burner doodle. I don't think burners need a lot of living space. They kind of just want to be right by you at all times. And I've heard people who live in big houses and their burner literally sits like by their feet the whole time. Do you need to go inside? Boys, you too hot? <laughs> what do you smell? What is that? Benny. What are you doing with your mouth? Don't bark. Come here, let's go inside. Nope, come on. Grab me water and my coffee. You 
close the door for me. <laughs> oh. breakfast oh you want some bacon when it's all done where do you get Benny treats um I usually will give him like carrots lately we made these for him Ready? Let's do it over here. Come over here. Come here. Sit. Lay down. Lay down. Benny, lay down. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Hey, 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 Benny. <gasps> You're so naughty. Hey. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. <laughs> he looks so mad. The heck? Okay, you can have it. Got my hand all disgusting. What? You have to eat it on the carpet? all over it. Should have eaten this outside. <laughs> it's actually frozen yogurt with blueberries and strawberries. <laughs> It'll make his poop kind of soft though, so we try not to give him too many. What do you clean Benny with? Um, we just use like a, like a anti-itch shampoo. Um, we don't bathe him very often. So I mean, I don't really spend too much on his shampoo since he doesn't really get a bath that often. If Benny could talk, what do you think his voice would sound like? So we've joked around about this. We have the voice that we give him, which, I mean, that's what we think his voice is, but we joke because they say that the burner is from Switzerland, so we always give him, like, a, their accent. Or we think maybe he has their accent. But we always do his voice for him. Um, how much is it to take him to the vet? Um, that is a hard question because like no matter what, it's going to be a different cost. Um, our most recent visit to the vet was because he had a cut on the inside of his mouth from a leaf. Like a leaf got stuck back there and like cut his mouth. And, the, and then I think the leaf was just back there for so long it kind of got like nasty. And his breath was smelling really, really bad. So we took him to the vet for that and they checked the bump. He has like a lump on his back and I asked them to check his ears because he's got a lot of buildup in his ears and his ears always stink. And that whole vet visit was probably including um, his antibiotics they gave us. It was like 60 something dollars. So it wasn't that much. And don't worry, the lump on his back is just a cyst and the buildup in his ears is normal for dogs that have floppy ears. We just have to make sure we clean them. Um, 
But, I mean, when we first got him, he was peeing blood. And they kept wanting to do, like, different tests. So they were trying to do... They did an ultrasound. They did x-rays. And I want to say in those that two-month span... But can you stop pushing on me? In that two-month span, we probably spent about $2,000 on vet expenses. Which... All he needed was to be neutered, and that would have only cost us $50. So, I mean, definitely find a vet who understands this breed. They did overcharge us a lot, which is why we spent so much money. Um, we switched to vets, and the vet actually, the one that we have now, owns a Bernice Mountain Dog. So, they'll understand. He'll understand him a little more. <coughs> Stop it! <coughs> you know we're talking about you and all your problems. Yeah, you were expensive when we first got you. Clean those eye boogies out. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it always will get it. <laughs> Give me it. <laughs> One of these days, man, this thing's gonna break. This is his oldest toy. <laughs> Drop it so I can throw it. Oh. <laughs> You savage animal. Does he need cool weather? Um, burners do like cool weather. Um, doesn't mean they can't live in warm weather. I mean, he was born here. There's a lot of burners that live in Florida. You just have to be a little cautious of when it's really hot outside. Ready? You don't want it? Should we dump out all your toys? Ugh. Sometimes he like forgets that he has toys because they're at the bottom of the bin. There's nothing left. It's all on the ground. What brushes do you groom him with? Um, we have a rake brush and a furminator that we use um, not as often, just usually when it's like he's having big blowouts. How long did it take to train? Um, it depends. It took, it was really fast to teach him like sit and leave it and lay down on those with those tricks. Those only, stop, I'm, don't, you don't need to follow me. <laughs> stop. Get your toys. Careful, you don't have to sit on me. Go over there. Don't, no, get out of here. No, he's sitting on me. Benny, you see people ask, oh, do they need a lot of room? No, because he's just sitting on me. Um, I will say, like, up until he turned probably one and a half, he was very stubborn and had a lot of energy, so it was just hard to train him. Now that he's two, he's a lot calmer. Has your dog ever been on a golf cart? He has not. When did your boy stop chewing, especially on you? Uh um, I would say a, probably about a year. When he Once he hit like a year, so much got better. Like it was, the first year was hard. And I mean, we only got him at eight months, so we didn't have him a full year. 
but is he rough when playing? Um, it depends. He can get a little rough. We try not to like wrestle with him so he's not like that when like kids play with him. Look at all these toys. Okay, hold on. I gotta check my, my breakfast. We're cooking bacon. I'm probably burning it. Was he potty trained when you got him? Um, he technically was potty trained when we got him, but he had the enlarged prostate, which was making him pee blood and um, causing an infection in his bladder, which made him like have tons and tons of accidents. <laughs> Buddies, hi buddies, cutie boy. Stop. You don't know. Any diarrhea problems at the beginning? Um, yeah, because he was on a really nasty food. Like a bad food dog shouldn't a dry a bad dry dog food. Stop. You're I can't speak. Um we switched his food without like slowly switching it like you're supposed to and he had diarrhea and he always gets diarrhea like when we moved to this new place he had diarrhea for a little bit because he was stressed out what <laughs> Penny, i gotta cook i gotta cook the eggs now he's throwing a tantrum right now He does this sometimes. Usually if we ignore him, he'll lay down and he'll just throw the tantrum. <coughs> what? <coughs> Stop. Stop it. How much does Benny weigh? He's 90 pounds. Where'd you get Benny? Off Craigslist. Stop it. <laughs> Look at it. You have so many toys. <gasps> Ready? You catch it? <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> Get it. <laughs> Get it. We've tried all different brushes. We have a bunch of them. Is Benny fully grown? Um, technically, no. He still has time to grow. I don't think he's going to get much bigger, but... <laughs> get him a moving toy. Um, wow. <sighs> he did have a moving toy, and he, like, broke it. Benny, I got to cook the eggs. Are you going to come help me? Should have cooked them while these were cooking. Come here. Hey. <laughs> Hi, buddies. We're going to have to end the vlog soon. I don't know how I'm going to cook. Okay, you cook these. Because my hand is holding the phone. We need some cheese. How much does Benny eat in a day? Um, he gets two cups in the morning and two cups at night. I'm trying to cook with one hand. You cook these for me? Since I'm recording you, do you wanna cook them for me? Uh. Maybe we can just like, I don't know where to put it. 
put it. <laughs> oh man. See, I don't want to like face this. You all want to see Betty, not me cooking eggs. Hold on. Throw those away later. Benny do the between the legs thing. I don't know what that is. Put a little cheese into eggs. A little salt and pepper. You want somebody? Does Benny flip your arm backwards, almost breaking it? Because he wants to be pet. Yeah, he does that a lot. Our dog eats six cups a day. We actually had to cut down his food because he was gaining too much weight. Again, right by me at all times. Buddies. Hold on, buddies. Why don't you come clean up your toys? Put them away. Come cook with me. Come here. Does he really pick up his toys? I want to teach my dogs useful tricks. No, he does not pick up his toys. <laughs> That'd be nice though, right? How old is Benny? He is two. <coughs> does he high five? Nobody does paw. Benny paw. <laughs> he wants the eggs. It's like, I'll just wait here patiently. Is Benny very protective? Um, he acts protective, but he gets scared easily. Benny is 90 pounds. Did you get a professional training for Benny? No, we did not. Is he on the slender side for a male? Yeah, his, his dad was only 75 pounds and his mom was 95 pounds. So Benny will be a smaller Bernice. Can Benny do my taxes? Of course he can. Sorry, I'm like trying to like stir the eggs with one hand. Like I said, Benny will be a smaller Bernice. Does he like the snow? 
Um, he has seen it. He doesn't really, I mean, he doesn't care. It's not like he rolls around in it or anything. He'll eat it. I just got a burner doodle. Anything I should expect? Um, I don't... I don't have a burner doodle, so I can't really tell you much about that. Do you want to breed Benny with another dog? He's neutered, so we cannot breed him. We actually had to neuter him early because of some medical issues. Excuse me, buddies, I just need to grab a plate. Oh, we have our big plates, I guess. All right. Well, I think we're going to have to end the live now because I got to put the breakfast together. So, Benny, you want to say bye to everybody? <laughs> like he's going to talk. All right, thank you guys for joining. Um, make sure you subscribe if you're new. Give the video a like. And we will have a video up on Monday or Tuesday of next week.